Hey, I'm Jake Steinfeld, the Body by Jake. And uh, I gotta tell you, we're here in Marina Del Rey at the Jamba Juice, and we're, we're, we're live. Sit with me is my old pal. I mean, John Sally, champion basketball player, movie star, television star, talk show host. I mean, you know, you name it. Now he's muscling in the fitness industry. <laughs> I figured I couldn't get him on the phone. I said, all right, you'll be on television. He's, now he's coming. I wanted, I wanted to Great be to like you, man. man. Great to I see tell you. you that, you know, to get paid to stay in shape, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to be 50 this year. Um, 50. Good yes. for you. God bless you. My I'll wife be... says I act like a 17-year-old. Good for you. Uh, and I just stay healthy. I, I literally did that. I literally saw a picture. And in the picture, I was, I was dark. And I thought, okay, the photographer had a bad light. And I look back at the picture and I look at the time. I was 290 pounds. Well, but you're also 6'11"? I like 6'11". Okay, you're 6'11". So, but I still have a heart. Uh, so yeah, when you gain you all go. that weight... You're making the heart work do harder. More, and I'm already making it do harder because there's a lot of sexy that blood has to be <laughs> pumped through. A lot of guys, after they leave professional sports, after training their whole lives, and we know a lot of right. guys who just leave it all alone and, and get real overweight, get, yeah. get real sick, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. You've been able to, you know, keep that lean. Yeah. You know, and, and it takes a lot of work, but well, how are you doing it? Well, that's, that's everybody in my family was dying from cancer. My father was dying of cancer, and every time I changed something, he went up and down. And I thought, it can't be a gene, because I have really good genes, and it has to be something. And what we shared was the recipes and the food. And so I changed the way I eat. I, I don't eat things that are dead. I don't eat things that are dairy. I don't eat things that don't feed the locomotive. That wasn't always though. No, no, I was a, I, okay. my mother was a caterer. I used to sell hot dogs in Brooklyn. Now, look, you've done it. It's over a course right. of a lot of years though, right? Yes. I mean, 1991, I became a lying vegetarian. I ate fish and chicken wings. And then uh, I turned 40, I decided I wasn't gonna lie anymore about anything. And then about 43, this girl said, you know, you need to stop saying you're vegetarian because when there's nothing <laughs> vegetarian you like, you eat a turkey burger. <laughs> and so I did this commercial for PETA and they had vegan food and the guy who made it uh, was named Dave he had a restaurant called um, Madame's Bistro in the valley once I tasted it and it tasted exactly like the dead flesh but without the guilt and without the recourse the consequence right the body does not process animal fat that's the reason I don't eat it and it's really unsexy to eat something dead. Talk to me about this product, yeah. Okay, so this is the natural male enhancer. Literally, it brings more blood to the region. This is the prostate maintained. Uh, every man will die from prostate or have prostate at one time in his life. Um, so this maintains it. The testosterone, it's not really for bodybuilding, it's for men maintained. Mine went down to 150. Which, wow, buddy. Yeah, I was crying. I was, I was watching television, <laughs> and I was crying. I was like, wow, it's, it's the Bra <laughs> Brady is such a great quarterback. You know, so I had to get my testosterone back up. <laughs> and then, uh, Brady, <laughs> you know, I, <laughs> I was crying over that. And uh, he lost. I cried. He was all right. He went home to Giselle. Uh, and then this product, literally, we just came out with, and it was important that we had something for women, because certain times it just dilates and brings more excitement and blood to the area as well. Drinking the Jamba Juice. This is really well, good. It is. Yeah, and that's the thing. You know, the great thing about Jamba too, what they're doing is, you know, over 800 stores and growing. And they're now transforming what you see back behind you here at, at this store, store in Santa Monica, uh, which is my store, is they're now including all the fresh squeezed, fresh blended juices along with the smoothies. Yeah, this I got to get great. a store, man. At least two of them. Well, let's we'll Is there one available it. in Santa Monica? We'll talk. Hey, easy does it. <laughs> easy does it. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Great to see you, man. All great right. to see you. Hey, remember, gang, stick to the fight when your heart is hit. It's when things seem worse, but you must not quit. Don't quit on you. Have a great day.